A man who murdered his seven-week-old son tried to portray himself as a heartbroken father by sharing tributes and asking for donations to the funeral. Oliver Maley, 26, was arrested soon after little Abel Jacks died in hospital from a brain injury which doctors said was consistent with the force of a car crash. Maley, from Burnley, Lancashire, eventually confessed in court to shaking the baby to death after flying into a fit of madness when he wouldn't stop crying, and was jailed for life on Wednesday. But he initially denied wrongdoing and pointed suspicion toward Abel Jacks's mum, Molly Gorton, and her other son, who has not been named. After being released under investigation shortly after Abel Jax's death in November 2021, repeatedly posted on Facebook calling his victim, Spud, and saying how much he loved and missed him. In February 2022 he shared a link to a GoFundMe appeal set up by Molly to raise money for the boy's funeral. Alongside the link he shared a picture of the boy and wrote, Please can everyone help me to lay my little spud to rest a little donations, we are struggling to lay him to rest and give him the best send-off he needs. Another post showed Maley cradling the boy with the caption, Words couldn't explain how much I need you and miss you spud daddy loves you and will never stop doing. The 26-year-old went so far as to get a tattoo of the boy's name and birth date on his neck. He shared a picture in July, the same month he was charged with murder in which the tattoo appeared to be fresh, captioning it, Love you spud. The posts provoked outrage on social media, with one user commenting, You killed him. And you're sick enough to post pictures like your father of the effing year. Another added, You've got to be joking me. How sick and twisted can one person be? You've taken people's money to fund the poor boy's funeral who you killed. Horrific lowest of the low. I hope to God you get everything you deserve. Molly had been cleared of suspicion two weeks after Abel Jax's death after police determined she could not have been at home when the baby was injured. Maley continued to lie about hurting Abel until December 2022, when he admitted manslaughter but continued to deny murder. Preston Crown Court heard Maley was a regular cannabis user and was unaware shaking could cause serious harm despite a health visitor warning both parents about its dangers during a routine home visit. Sentencing, Mr Justice Cotter said there was nothing unusual about Abel's behaviour that would have driven Maley to his wit's end. He said, the evidence before this court showed Molly to be a loving and devoted mother. Your actions caused her to lose her beloved son. Her family was blown to pieces. She left home to go to work and returned to what would be a living nightmare for any mother. She had to plan her baby's funeral alone while under suspicion of murder. Maley must serve a minimum of 16 years before he is eligible for parole. Our sincere condolences and heartfelt sympathies go out to the family and loved ones of baby Abeljacks.